Hello Libra, welcome to your he said she said spread. Say hello to Richard. Hello. And we're here for the week of July 1st, 2018. Now, don't forget we've got our special going at the moment for personal he said she says. So if you're interested in that, give me an email, gypsyinsights at gmail.com. The cost is $35 for a 20 minute reading and we can do that for you and your partner or potential partner as well. Also, don't forget to check out my monthly spreads. I do those twice a month. I have the mid-Julys out right now. Uh, so please go and check those out. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Now, let's get along with your reading, Libra. From Le Vampire, you've pulled Call for Help. Reach out. A need for backup and admit your needs. Now, with this one, it, it's really speaking about how I'm feeling with this card is that you may be feeling hurt, attacked in some way. Someone may have feel made you feel weakened or made you feel like a victim in some way. But but I, I don't like the word victim. I, I feel it's more about feeling hurt and attacked by someone around you. We also have from the Energy Oracle, the second chakra, Archangel Ariel. Now with this one, it speaks about uh, the need to nurture yourself. So I feel that, that something's happened here, Libra, which has made you, made you feel down, made you feel like uh, your needs are not being met here. Like you were being hurt and attacked and now you need to, to nurture yourself to recover from this. Yeah, I, I get a sense of uh, a need to a need for assistance for healing is, is what I get with these cards. So let, let's get along with your reading and see how this plays out for you, Libra, <coughs> for the week of July 1st, 2018, for Libra, for air sign. The first energy, ooh, a little preview there. I'll, I'll turn that up. <laughs> <laughs> We've got uh, your partner's energy, your partner's attributes or what they bring to the table, the flaws of your partner, what your partner feels about you, how you feel about your partner, the strengths of the relationship, weaknesses of the relationship, the potential for a healthy relationship crossed by any roadblock, and the potential outcome. So let's see what we have here for you, Libra. So as the energy, we have the, the hanged man mm. as your partner's energy. So I, I feel that uh, there's an energy here of, of letting something go, making a sacrifice, and uh, perhaps seeing something from a different perspective as well. But, but I feel that here it, it may be something that this person is needing to let go of it could be a person it could be a behavior but there's something that needs to change here i feel yeah, it's not a bad card necessarily no it, it could be that this person is getting ready to release something here that that is not good for them or uh, or or, or they may have released you, Libra, because of these uh, these oracle cards. So let's see where this goes. As their attribute or what they bring to the table, they have the, the wheel of the year or wheel of fortune. So here, as their attribute, I feel that uh, th there's an energy with this card of... <coughs> needing to it may have been something that came around again from the past this person may have been this may have been a second chance with this person well we could put it together with the hanged man as well uh, and it could be looked upon as being a turning point it could be that as well yeah uh, definitely um, they could be getting ready for positive changes, making positive changes. And giving something up that they need to give up. So let's see, uh, let's have a look at the, uh, the flaws here. And with the Six of Swords, reading this as a flaw, I feel that this is all about, uh, there may have been some, 
something that this person was tied to that they found it hard to move away from. It could have been some emotional baggage from past relationships. Unfortunately, it could also be this relationship as well. It could be that as well, but I, I get a sense with these three cards, reading them together, that this person is, is starting to release themselves from something that may have held them back from moving on from something that was quite stormy and and now that they may be readying themselves to to get that uh, wheel turning back in their favor so let's see what they uh, what they think of you libra the five of swords ooh mm, that's some harsh energy now this could uh, how i feel with this reading is that this could read the other way around so if this is not you libra this could be what someone else is it could read the opposite way vice versa and the reason why i say that is because if if they feel that you your energy is the five of swords they may be feeling defeated in some way and uh, maybe you're bullying them but yeah with these two cards here the the call for help it seems like you could be the victim of the bullying. That's why I thought it, it, it seemed to, it might be switching mm. here, the energies, because I, I get with the Five of Swords, there's an energy here of someone who argues for the point of, just, just for the sake of arguing and being very hurtful with their words. Yeah, I think that's a great way to think of the Five of Swords. <clears throat> now let's see what you think of your partner here, Libra. The star in reverse. So there's a loss of a loss of faith in this relationship, a loss of hope. It, it seems to be something that started out quite uh, positive. Uh, you seem to be giving up uh, here in terms of uh, this relationship. There's a lot of disappointment with this card, and not seeing the way uh, clearly here towards something that is going to be. Uh, 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 with, with a lot of inspiration and hope for the future here. I, I get that as well. <clears throat> so let's have a look at your strengths of the relationship. And you have karma, which is the card, of the judgment card. And it is coming up in reverse. So as a, a, a strength here, we'll, we'll read it in the upright. And the judgment card in the upright is very much a card. Again, I get second chances, reconciliation. Balance and fairness as well. And, uh, and choice, decisions. But, but I feel more so for you, Libra, it, I feel that this relationship was something that came back from the past with this wheel and, and, the, uh, and the judgment card here. I, I'm getting an energy of something that's come around again and i feel like you both wanted this second chance but something's happened here something's happened that there may have it may have just been an argument richard it may have just be as simple as that as just a, a misunderstanding a falling out here where where your partner libra ha thinks of you as uh, someone who has hurt them in a way here i'm picking it up as as words with this five of swords i'm picking this up as an argument and with the star in reverse i feel that uh, after this argument uh, libra you, you've you've given up hope here or, or losing faith now let's have a look at the weaknesses of this relationship we have the six of wands in reverse so there's a sense here that y that you can't work together here to for success there's a, a sense with this card of, of feeling like you're almost defeated, right? Defeated, like that you're you're both unable to achieve a victory here. There's no successful outcome. No, lack of cooperation for a successful outcome. I think that's right. Now let's have a look at your potential for a healthy relationship. You have the two of wands in reverse. And the shadow side, which is the devil card. So, <clears throat> with these two cards together, it's not looking so good for a healthy relationship here, I have to say, Libra. 
The two of wands in reverse is a lack of uh, seeing your way forward. It's a uh, not not uh, a lack of planning. Lack of creativity, perhaps a lack of finding some sort of creative solution to one's problems. And what's holding you back is the devil. So there's some kind of... Obsession, possibly addiction. It could be addiction. It could be that this person is... Uh, has a an addiction to uh, I'm, I'm picking it up as as a substance or a, uh, it could even be a, a drug use here but but i get an energy here that that you're not seeing the way forward with this person because of this i'm picking it up as addiction to a substance and, and i and i get an energy here that uh, you're losing faith here libra and and you've you've had an argument you've you've probably called this person out about this energy here and uh, now they feel defeated in some way they, they they're hurt by your words but i feel like you needed to say it libra well the, you do have the hangman and the turning and the wheel so maybe that's what was needed to get this person to sit up and take notice that's right then. that they needed to, to change this right. here so let's have a look at your outcome, Libra. The Two of Swords in reverse. So you've had a lot of conflict about making a decision about this relationship, but now I feel your, you, your energy is that you need to make this decision. The time is right for you to make this decision. I get the energy of it being a bit stuck right now because this decision hasn't been made. Yeah, that definitely. But I feel it's a decision that has to be made. For this person's good, I, I, I get that because it, it seems to be something that they need to hear or they, they need to get called out on here because it's holding you back. It's holding you back from making those plans for the future. And, uh, and as long as this behavior continues, I feel like you, you're both going to be stuck in this Six of Wands energy where you, you're both not achieving what you want to achieve here which is i feel you both want success here I, I get that you've i get that this is a second chance some kind of a, a reconciliation here and for you libra i i feel that this needs to change before you can even make plans with this future uh, with this partner and for you with this call for help card libra I feel that you may need assistance here with this person's we're picking it up as as, a, as it could be any kind of uh, addiction but I'm picking it up as a, a substance abuse here it, it could even be a, uh, a sexual addiction it, it could be anything like that but I feel that for you Libra the important thing is that you you need to try not to do this alone because I, I feel that it may be too much for you to, to take on by yourself here. You yeah, protect yourself, nurture yourself, and uh, keep 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 hope. Keep up hope. Keep up hope, and but also look out for your own needs. Because I know that you may want to help this person. I get that, Libra. But the, the most important thing is that you don't, in trying to help this person, you, you don't lose sight of your own needs at the same time now let's uh i want to get one clarifier here on this two of swords in reverse what is the outcome for libra with this situation here i feel like this person wants to change i do but they're having a hard time let's have a look we've got the knight of cups the Page of Swords in Reverse and the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, Libra. I, I feel that, that the Page of Swords here is, I feel it's you having this, this argument with this person. I'm picking it as a, up as an argument, but it, it could have just been some harsh truth being given to this person that if they don't shape up here, that that uh, that you you're on the way out. That uh, that you can't uh, put up with this behaviour anymore. And I feel that this is you, with this energy, and it may be that after this, 
with this Knight of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles, there's an opportunity here to get what you need in terms of a stable, secure environment in, in your home. Because I feel that once this truth is, is told to this person, they might actually do something here and, and get this person uh, some help. And, uh, and with the Knight of Cups here, there may be an energy of uh, coming, this co person coming around again and, uh, and offering uh, love to you, but, but without this, uh, this shadow side here, the, this addiction getting in the way, whatever that may be. Libra. So I think we'll leave it there and uh, wish you all the best with this Libra. Don't forget Libra, we've got that special on the personal he said, she said spreads. And the, the cost for that is $35 for 20 minutes. You'll get both myself and Richard. Email us at gypsyinsights at gmail.com. Please don't forget to check out my channel, Gypsy Insights by Michelle. And there I do the, uh, the in-depth readings. So if, if, uh, if you'd like to find out more information about that, uh, click below. And please like, share and subscribe. Thank you again, Libra. Bye, Libra. Good luck.